What's up, guys? Uh, just hanging out late at night. Oh, look at that! Look at that pronator just popping. Hey, eh? look at that! Look at that thing just sitting there. Everything's going good. Training's good. I think I'm light. I think I'm like 265, 267. Uh, but I'm old and I'm very weak. And all the Europeans have nothing to be afraid of because you can lift more weight than me and, um, and I'm scared of you. So figure out who I'm pulling here pretty soon. I just thought I'd just show, just so everybody can relax a little bit and know that you have nothing to worry about. Show you a little pronation lift. Pronation. The key to strap pulling. Never hold on. Always run away. If someone wants to mess with you, they can come to you. Okay, you don't hold on. Nobody holds on to anybody. All right? Let the strap do that. Anyways, what do we got here? What do we got? See if you can see me. I don't know if you can see this. Back a little bit. Pronation. 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 Easy. Easy. What is that? Is that is that strength phase or is that power phase? Hard to tell the speed at which I threw that thing up. Don't hold on. Never hold on, guys. If there's no power in holding on. August 26. How are you guys doing today? As some of you know, I sometimes give seminars. I try and appeal to... Uh, the mainstream mostly like uh, I try and teach to a, a level that everyone can benefit from this video that I'm gonna show now is the pinnacle the peak okay so if you're a beginner I'll tell you probably stick with your rise cup roll tell your guys to be careful with this one so what can I say about this advanced procedure I'm gonna show you here okay we deal mostly with the strap. You should carry straps with you everywhere you go. It's gonna consist of equipment maintenance, okay? The strap. Sometimes when you leave it in your pocket, it gets folded up. They're gonna internally rotate all the time, okay? They're gonna, their, their shoulders will become tight on the inside, okay? And also, also we're doing a lot of cupping and pronation, it's very common. Okay, you need to open up, you need to open up, you see. Okay, you can change your grip, you can change your grip. Okay, over the back, over the back, through the thumb, through the thumb. Cup it down, tricep, tricep. Bring balance and symmetry to the body. Today we're working dexterity, equipment familiarity. Okay, overall body conditioning and fitness. All right. Know your equipment. Become familiar. Master your equipment. Build your chi. When you show up in the practice, circle. Pull out your strap. Do your draw. Increase your tempo. Listen to the sound. Listen to it. Listen. Listen. As you get louder. Until it whips cracks let your opponent know what's coming let them know what's going to happen to their bones to their soul as it cracks it's probably about up to 150 right now i do this for 20 minutes i'll probably be about 180 by the time i'm done all right so listen see if you can match me Not my first time. Why don't you be on the poster like one of those big meaty chickens? The ones that has their lungs collapsed by the time they're seven months old because they have too much meat on them. Hey, that'd be perfect for you, a big chicken with no balls. 
Hey, perfect, huh? What do you need so much time for? Oh, that's right. Listen, I hope you have a long life. Last time you beat me and then you died afterwards. I wish you a long life, Dennis. Be careful. <laughs>